and three and four and ouch! Here, dig around this bump. I don't dig digging. The treasure of the ages will be mine. <laughs> Ours. The other way, brilliant. Oh. 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 This sure is a messy office for a private detective. Look at that bulletin board. Oh, poster. Wanted. The professor. Rock bottom. Rock bottom and the professor. Why, they're not even in jail anymore. I hope they have learned their lesson. Just a little more, Rock. Gee, this is worse than the old rock pile. Mm. Oh, oh. There, Rock. You've uncovered it. To learn the secret of the treasure, wrap the left paw three times. Three hard wraps, Rock. I made for pleasure. Inside of one, I hid a treasure. The treasure! I'll search till I find it. Search a thousand pyramids? Oh, brother! Hello? Felix, private detective speaking. Hello? Yeah. 
yes, Felix. Oh, oh, my poor pyramids. Don't worry, Sam. Everything is under control. Okay, Felix. Good. This is the last pyramid. The treasure's got to be in this one. Wow! We found it! Ours! Ours! All ours! We found a treasure! 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 We! Now for the flying handcuff trick! <laughs> Felix, he can't do this to us. I sure can. Here's cement. A cement mixer. And the police. A trowel for you and you. Now you can cement the pyramids back together again. A thousand pyramids. Oh. Gee. That would take a lifetime. Venus. 
master cylinder, and I've been caught by this big monster. I wonder what happened to Poindexter. Well, if I must work for you, Mr. Cylinder, what is my assignment? Hmm, let me see. Make me a nice, practical, anti-gravity generator. Very well, Mr. Cylinder. It's finished. Now to test it. reflexes with my force ray generator, Mr. Felix. Oh! Now let's find the flying saucer and go home. Yes, Mr. Felix. Uncle must be worried about us. Help! Mr. Felix, help! Poindexter, where are you? Inside this plant, Mr. Felix. Mr. Felix. Well, that takes care of that ferocious rotabaga. The master cylinder. And he's got the flying saucer. Don't worry, Mr. Felix. I've got one more trick up my sleeve. Yeah? What is it? My latest invention. A little anti-gravity gun with a wallop. What's the, what's the wallop? The master cylinder will be suspended helplessly in space. He's up in the air. Yes, it works better than I thought. Poindry, is this the end of the master Goodness, no, Mr. Felix. His gravity will return in about a week. Good. We'll be home by then. <laughs> hey, Professor, can that be Felix I hear? with his friends. When he gets closer, we'll grab him. One thing I admire about Felix is that he can take a good joke, huh, Professor? Gosh, they aren't mad at me anymore. Okay, Buster, get out of that Jeep. This time, Felix, I'll sink you real deep. Here's a good spot. The soil's kinda loose. And this desert sun will soon cook your goose. I guess I'm sunk this time, and that hot sun will roast me. I feel like a sizzling hamburger already. Hello, Mr. Gopher. Gopher, you saved my life. Goodbye, 
Mr. Gopher. Rock bottom, if Felix gets away again, I'll boil you in oil. Uh-oh. I'd better step on the gas. Hmm, looks like a dead end roll. Danger, dynamiting today. I'll just drive off the road and out across the desert. Felix must have doubled back. He wouldn't be fool enough to drive right into the dynamite area. He couldn't have gone that way. Quick, Rock Bottom, back the other way. Sure changed my luck. You fathead. You led us right into that dynamite. I was following you, Professor. Just so he could crack safe. 
apes with his great strength. That's right. You're not robbing any more banks as long as I'm a detective. Get rid of him, Rock. Put him in that old big safe. Toss him in, Twinkle. You pay yet. <laughs> Relax, chum. Here, listen to the radio. Now it's locked. Time to go, Rock. Might as well turn on the radio. This is better. Now to think. Make him hurry, Rock. Come, Twinkle. Get in there, Twinkle, old kid. Do your stuff. We have other banks to visit. Why, of course. My secret two-way ankle radio. Attention. The Guild Edge Bank has just been robbed. It's too late to stop them. But... Hello? 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 Police Chief Hazard? Felix, I'm in a safe. Bring your men to... Felix, Felix, do you know the combination? Some numbers scribbled here on the door. Try them. Right four, left 60, right nine. Chief, get your men into the safe. Attention, march. with some oysters. Boss, we lost our safe cracker. So what? We've got plenty of money and plenty of time. You'll get plenty of time, but without money. Says who? Who? Why, it's obvious. Oh, what's the use? X7Z. A giant meteor is plunging to Earth. Attention, the path of the giant meteor is 7 east by north northwest. Latitude 46.2 degrees. Velocity darn fast. Bad news, Mr. Felix. The meteor is heading straight for this laboratory. We'll be smashed! To smithereens, Mr. Felix. But we can handle this. With my little atomic jet pusher, we can push that rock right out of the solar system. Sounds great, Poinsy. But how are we going to get up there? In my little flying saucer. Now let's get going. We're off. the meteor now. Good! Let's land on it! And now we'll attach this 
I'll take that, young man. Yikes! The master cylinder! So you sent that meteor plunging to Earth. Look out! Yes, and now you are my prisoners. You can't do that to Mr. Felix. You tell him, Poinsy! What now, Mr. Cylinder? I need a scientist in my laboratory. And you'll do. But, but what about me? You? You're going back to Earth. But fast. Well, how about this claw? Claw? Oh, that. I've got a million of them. We're gonna hit the Earth! And when we hit, bravo! Mr. Cylinder, but what about me? Make me a nice, practical, anti-gravity generator. A little laboratory? For me? Very well, Mr. Cylinder. It's finished. Now to test it. <laughs> I hope 
the professor won't bother me today. <laughs> Felix is so wrong. Of course I'll bother him with my latest invention. Now I can turn into anything instantly. <coughs> now it will be easy to get the magic bag from Felix. <laughs> and Felix won't ever know what happened. I shall turn into a rose bush. <coughs> It needs water. There. It needed a good soaking. That Felix, he dampened my efforts again. I'll get the bag while his back is turned. It went by me! It's coming back! I'm dead! 
Mr. Felix, why not?
message for you, Mr. Felix. From my uncle. Dear Felix, let's be friends. Be my guest for the weekend, and you'll see I can be nice. The Professor. P.S. Bring your magic bag. Don't trust him, Mr. Felix. But an offer of friendship. Hmm. I'll go. My magic bag will protect me. Now that I have the magic bag, <laughs> I will be as great as my famous ancestor. 700 years ago, he ruled the world with magic. <laughs> Go to the invention room, quick! The professor's time machine! Say, I'll set it back and start the day over! <laughs> Aha! Mr. Felix, we haven't had any villains in the family since. <laughs> <laughs> 
He lost his magic wand 700 years ago. This one? Oh, does it work? Sure. <laughs> Rule the